Somewhere. I've already missed my A laners. I've got to get into my email here and see exactly what we're looking for. There is an A98 and an A85. My big one is D160, I know I need to find here. So I'm going to get to my day. Now, all these are government cars coming through over here. That was a 2010, I think it was a Charger, Hemi Charger. And that black one I was looking at there, and it had 33 or 32,000 miles. And I knew it from my list. A1 through 30 over there is the government cars. Holy hell, a 14 with 26,000 on it. Wow, the exterior is still pretty, pretty much look the same as 12 years ago or so. Okay, now, I had had this car on my list. I don't look at them unless they're just amazing. Right in here. And it's got a badge and it's looking pretty amazing. Actually, this is a special car with them wheels, I believe. It was the second one. It's got the heritage of ownership. I dig these. Oh man, the interior's kind of thrashed. I know it's got about 120 on it or so. And with these 4.9s, these cars are just the bomb. Now, I didn't like that sound at all. I like them wheels, though. Bummer. It's not that clean. I bet you could run the, run the heck out of this car, though. For sure. Okay, I'm going to skip that. I think that's the only thing in the A lane for me. Oh, no, no, no. I said there was a turbo, number 98. 850 turbo. Hey, look, junk. Two hundred thousand miles. Okay. This thing is in here. And I've had a couple people mention them to me. And I like them wheels. And I've kept saying if I could find a clean one. Look at that. Just awful. Almost looks like overspray more than fading. That's awful. Okay. Only had 137 on it. It's been here a few weeks though. The seats are decent. See the chair there? Yeah, doesn't that figure? Well, without being able to start it, it's gonna put me far behind on this car. Hey man, there's no way you could jump that Volvo real quick, is there? Oh my gosh, sure. Awesome, dude. Thank you very much. I know you're busy and running here. Jump it in? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Now they just closed a... a sound. But... I'm not hearing it. I'm not hearing a sound, man. 
Um, it's running a little rough. Ah. He's got some problems, or the battery's so dead. No, the battery can't be that dead. I would buy this car for super cheap. It'd have to be super cheap, and it could go super cheap. I'm glad it shut off to where no one else can see it, at least. Okay, more junkie. This was here. 177 or so on it, I think. Ha! 177. The guy's good. The guy's good. Okay, there was a... Dodge pickup or two here. I was gonna look at. Hey, look at them. The Zuzu trucks are way too new. Okay, let's see. Oh, A103. It's probably at my there. Mazda MPV. That's a quest. I can't tell the difference. Wait a second. I'm past this one. 103 would be. Bam! Yes. A couple of scratches and dents. Oh, that's what there was I wanted to see over there. There was a Pacifica with like 22,000 miles. That could be it going through right now. There's an Explorer Sport Track going through. That almost guaranteed. Sorry about that. Here's the one that was on my list. I'm just here to look around and get to this D190 in a relatively good time when I can look at it before the auction, which should be relatively easy. It's pretty late in the day. I do this every now and then where like, I don't want to come to the auction. I don't need anything. I am detailing and got my plate full for sure. Look at the bumper on that thing. I'm gonna go look at the bumper on that truck. And with that in mind, I'll come down here when I see a couple things online that are just like, whoa. Look at that bumper. That is a boomer and a half. You aim for deer with that fucker. There's my sea lane. How's it going? You know, the people down here at this auction are either the nicest people in the world or just like, I work at the auction and you're a douchebag that's here just bidding. It's just kind of amazing. The randomosity. Randomosity. Yeah, I made that up right now as I was talking. Of the way people are at this auction. That's my STX. And there's somebody getting in it. That's a nice figure. Don't you just hate that? Don't you just hate that? I mean, I put a charge on them when I'm selling them. You know, I don't want them to start for somebody that's looking. I actually came to look at this one, you know? I heard you and I knew. Me too. 97,000 miles, yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> No, I did not. You got a beat up brake pad for 50,000 miles. Beat up brake pad. He's trying to steal it. Huh. 
I'm betting that's original miles. Beat up brake pedal, my asshole. 56,000 on this nice little truck with the books. Ron Baker. It's still a bow tie emblems. I think this is a Ron Baker Chevrolet trade in. I like it. It's clean up here. 4.0. Is it a Mazda or a Ford? It's a Ford. Yeah, I like that truck. How much is this thing going to go for? Let's see the mileage. 174. Broken seat. What a piece of shite. I do like that truck though. Okay, let me look at my F lane listings here. E160, that's what it was. F66. I gotta be pretty close to that one. Yeah, I've been looking for a nice exploder. Lately, I just missed this sixty seven D. See, I'm lost. F sixty six. That's it. Got some pain issues here on the front. Coming off everywhere. Hold, don't move. Yeah, this is a little bit too thrashed for me. Motor propo. Okay, I'm gonna go. This guy's still scared, I'm gonna creep up on him. E. So let's just get to the E lane because this is the one I really want. <coughs> Problem is, it's gonna be about a hundred cars out. Actually, I seriously am loving this red van up here. Wow, look at that color. It almost looks brown. It kind of looks purple. It kind of looks maroonish. That's a beautiful color. Really rare. Huh. Okay. 128 on that van. Probably a 5.4. 128. It's got a warning light. Or caution. I don't know what that little warning light is in the corner. It's an exclamation point. Oh wait, far too new for Nate. Not interested, not going to try and sell something that expensive. It's not that it's super, super, super. Yeah, I thought so. This is the ultimate edition. And I don't know if it's going through or not. This has got that same warning. I'm just not familiar enough with this year Ford to know what it is. I don't know. I can't even get the miles on this thing. Probably just don't know how to do that. Leave this thing running, it's gonna get out of gas soon.
<laughs> it died. Okay, D. A, B, C, D, E. Wow. I think I did say it was an E and not a D now. Well, not now. We're always been D100, E64, E160. Okay, let's see where we are here. E. E160 is going to be towards this end. I believe. E143. Where would E149? Where would the E's go from here? Wow. Okay, so you get down to this end and the E's end. <laughs> kind of a problem for me. I'm thinking they'll start up at the top somewhere here. This could be it. E1 something. 170. Yeah, we're in the mini. Super Sport. You know, some people ask me, well, why do you just walk by stuff and don't even look at it? I looked at this car online and I knew it wasn't something I wanted um, based on the mileage. It doesn't look like it's got the mileage they claim, though. And other than that, yeah, it does, though. 229. Nice little car. <laughs> Get me. See, and that's why I don't look. Now you see, because now, of course, I'm interested. Go get him in that little piece of junk, buddy. Oh, why did I have to even look? Now I've got to pop a hood. Okay, now in my mind, it's really hard to believe that I'm looking at this right here over that right there. I'm just not, it's not how I grew up. Um, it's not what I'm used to, but there's no doubt about it. This is a better car than that car. Um, that has 226,000 miles, is okay on the cleanliness. This has a little scuff right there. I don't think I'd even do anything to. No bumps or bruises, but there is that sandy scratch there. If you can see that, and not much of it's going to buff out. They gouged something right there, man. Sure did. Big old gouge. Right down the side. Right behind the door. Top roof rack looks good. Back looks awesome on this car. Miscellaneous chips on bumpers. Good plates. All the lenses are good. This side looks clean as can be. Tires, decent. Interior, here we go. This one's kind of rare with the leather loaded leather baby it's nice and plush too here's the beauty of it 44,000 miles dead battery someone left that on too on purpose I'll bet oh wow Wow, that sounded loud. Toyota maintenance folio. This thing is brand new. Pretty cool. The only thing cooler would be if this was a... <laughs> like a manual all-wheel drive. I don't think they made that. This is cool, man. Um, I'm going to stick around and bid on this. It's definitely cool. Wow, tight. Very tight. I wish I could start it. Look at this. Gob of keys. I could literally replace anything I need to. 
that's tight. It's nice to feel. Man, I like that wore that out pretty good. Let's look at the pedals for the heck of it. <laughs> Brand new. Yeah. One sweet car. I'm all over this like stink on cheap. Would I have ever thought that this would be? Well, I look at that little four cam 24 valve motor. Four cylinder. These are, this will clean up nice too. These are good motors from what I hear. I like it. I just think somebody, I think he smashed that side up a bit too. I'm going to try to take a picture. Add me on Instagram. It's one owner car guy. No, excuse me. It's Instagram.com forward slash cereal marshmallows. And I do all kinds of stupid pictures like this. Yeah, that's what I do. Okay, well, thanks for watching. Have a great day or night. Whatever it is, wherever you are, oneownercarguy.com. Can't get a better picture of that. So I'm done. This is interesting though. What is that? 160 and 161. Could make for something guy needs to look at. Okay. Well, that is the walk around. You're not really going to get a chance to see everything because I don't have a bunch of time in front of me to look at everything and I don't want to look at everything. Then I'll end up wanting things. All I want is that little, hey, Mary Kay car. All I want is that little 208, maybe. All I want is that little Toyota. Where's the Mary Kay sticker? If I was a Mary Kay rep, you'd just get your own and paint it pink. Then people just think it was that. You're a big seller. Yep, that's me. I didn't get a Cadillac, <laughs> got a Grand Am. Triton V10, baby. That's the kind I like. Lone Mart. I'm gonna dually. Clean inside. 132. Not totally out of control. Well. Clear coat peel everywhere. Scratchy scuffied. Both sides. Lights knocked out of both sides. Cool flames. I got something good to say about it, right? I'm not even wanting to look. I don't even know what year this is. Okay. That's our preview. I'm going to keep this rolling for a bit longer. Maybe go preview some going through. Ooh, a bug. You know, it always bugs me when it says do not move on them. Needs okay. Do not move. See, that makes it seem like almost maybe it's okay. This thing's just a little bit too... Yeah. Pretty tight on the door close. Rare to see older stuff like that here very much. Huh. Shocks anyone? Oops. 
I think this guy's coming right where I am. Yeah, he was. Get run over. Oh, high mileage Bronco was here. It's the almost OJ Mobile. You know, it shouldn't be an OJ Bronco. It should be a Al Cowlings Bronco. That was his name, Cowlings. I know that was his name. Let's see here. Back to this purple truck I seen a few weeks ago. It's here again. I don't know what happened. I didn't see it sell, but other people said it sold. Well, it's super clean inside. Nice truck. That always worries me when it's back and it's supposedly sold. I had to cut it out there on the Astro. Cut it out! Got a little bit too much music blurge. Breeder's out in the car. I'm gonna go catch her and take her for a walk. Let her do her morning constitutions. Beautiful day. I'm gonna walk around inside just a little while and show you what's in here, I guess. We'll look at some bidding. See what some things sell for. How's that? How is that? Gotta hear some ticking. Tick, 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 tick. About 75 cars until the one I want. I'm looking for C73. Ten more cars in that lane. I might go back down and just look. Do some more previous. Oh, there's my truck. Can you clip it in reverse real quick and just kind of let me field engage? Cool, thank All you, right. thank you. Feel okay for the last block and a half? Yeah, oh yeah. It's just awesome miles for that kind of a year. Uh -huh. And it actually runs better than what it looks. Once this is washed up, you know what I mean? Oh yeah. Well see, it was dead back here, we couldn't start it. Oh, is that right? So I think somebody started it before the run, of course. Yeah. We'll see. Okay. That truck could go absolutely cheap. I'm going to look it up in my Mannheim market report. It's going to take me a second. And I have people saying in my videos, why is he always looking to stop looking at your phone, butthole? Stuff like that, you know? Well, I'm not able to do that when I got cars coming through that I got a bid on or find. I need my list and I need my information. I'm gonna go inside here. Oh six Hyundai Tucson. I'd give them 2,500 bucks in a heartbeat, I think. But I don't think so. 
And actually, I'd rather have that. I don't know. I like the camera. Oh, that's why. We didn't want to press it. Jack, you're not that meaningful. I see that's why you're here. Jack, you're the one in the group. It's a great battle. Ask Lex. Don't think about it. Let's get it back. Don't let me have it. I'll tell. Back to heaven. Number four down. This is number four. 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 Number four
Beaglespocket.com and hear anything there or see lots of puppies. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night. Whatever it is, wherever you are, we'll talk to you. It's funny. You see people staring at you because they see the Google Glass. Mm. Any car you want. Any car you want. E101. They're sure pumping them through that lane. Okay. I'm really sending it off this time. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment. We'll talk to you. Actually, I'll watch this little piece of junk go through on the way out. If you want some little Honda piece of junk, here you go, man. I'll get you a deal. There's 200,000 on this. Nice, clean, rust-free body.
six fire six three seventy five one forty three four hundred by fifty five dollars on S X T four green green guarantee constant in there he go and takes five to buy he goes
down to my car. Three more, four more cars. I've got a couple people on it. They don't sound it. Wow. Could you clip it in reverse real quick with the brake on so I can feel it engaged? Yeah, you can. Everybody does that. You're an idiot. No, you weren't told not to do that. You're a liar now, too. Fuck you. Well, now we'll have to go around and do it a different way. I'll bid from the scatters. And there he goes in. So here I'll go in. I want to look at that Impala too. car, especially for that money. Like you said, a seat top is worth three bills. Okay, I don't know anything else I need to do besides just leave. So thanks for watching. Have a great day or night, whatever it is, wherever you are. It's a total waste. I didn't buy nothing. That's how it goes sometimes. I could have paid 19.
maybe 21 and got that Toyota, but I didn't want it. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you. These things go through pretty fair prices, I'll bet. Let's see them. 20 grand they can't get. Okay, I am totally out of here. Anything you need, I can get you from the auction. I will save you huge money. Plain and simple. I mean, unique stuff for sure, too. Yeah. 29,000 miles on a 2013. I'll definitely put a little bit of extras on it. Interesting. Very interesting. Add me on Instagram. Instagram.com forward slash serial marshmallows. These go so cheap. It's gonna be hard to get this picture. I ain't gonna get it. Maybe right here. That's an offer. Okay, give me a call. If there's anything you want, any kind of car. I especially do well on like behind 2000, like mid 90s, early 2000s. Make you a great deal. I'll be your buying agent. I'll save you thousands. 25 to 50% or more, seriously. And get you a cleaner, lower mile car. OneOwnerCarGuy.com. Nathan, 406 546 8748. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you. I think that's it. Nothing I even want to see.